What's up, Caspi? I would like to extend an invitation to you, Dad, for me to come on that there sofa. Oh, I love to be included in this. I love a sofa cuddle. I really do, my babber. So how about it, Dad? No, I caught you and Crumpet eating out of the bin earlier. You're not coming on the sofa. Slanderous. No, it's not. I caught you red-handed, Casper. I'm pretty sure you mean red-poured, my babber. We don't have hands. It is silly sausage. Yeah, it's just a saying. Don't worry. It just seems unfair, Dad. Not unfair. If you get caught eating out of the bin, you've got to reap the consequences. Dad, I wasn't even there at the time of the offence. I was over there by the door, see? Casper, I literally saw you. So neither of you are allowed on the sofa because you were eating out of the bin. End of. Well, do you care to explain the situation that is happening right this moment? What situation that's happening? Well, if you'd like to take a look down and right, Father, you'd see what I'm talking about. Don't you bring me into this! Bet and Daisy wasn't eating out of the bin. Yeah! Oh, well played, Dad. Oh, I am flabbergasted at this. I could not believe this is happening to me. Well, what do you expect, Casper? You and Crumpet were being naughty. Daisy wasn't, so she got to come Dad, up. do you think I was the orchestra of this operation? Absolutely not. Right, so it was Daisy that got you to climb in the bin? Oh, absolutely. Barbara, I do a lot of her bidding. Yeah, she seems formidable. Inspiring fear or respect from being impressively large or powerful, Barbara. I know, I said it. So what say you now, Dad? Now you know she was involved the whole time. Well, I can only take your word for it, Casper. Oh, Father, how you tire me so. Copy right, drop me in and then you blubber my... I'm sorry, my Barbara, it just spills out. Well, I can't just take your word for it anyway, Casper. She's innocent at the moment. Well, maybe you should try harder, Dad, instead of jumping to conclusions. What do you want me to do? Stand watching with a net? Who on earth is a net, Father? How dare you? No, a net, as in a big net. Oh, I just can't believe my ears, Father. I'm going to have to inform Mum of your treachery. No, Casper, you're listening to the wrong thing. I'm not talking about a woman. Exactly what you'd say if you were talking about a woman. Dad, you know where this is going? You may as well give up. No, I've not done anything. That sofa looks mighty nice. Right, you know what? If it's going to save all this hassle, then come on. Oh, what an unexpected surprise. I don't mind if I do, Dad. Right, you're happy now, and there's still no net. You know that, right? Oh, that's all in the past, Dad. Let's stay here forever. Literally ten seconds ago. I feel like I've got the short end of this deal. You don't sit still. Right, we'll try again, Casper. Okay. We're asking people if they like the content to follow and share the page. Dad, we've spoken about this before. It's not right to do this. Yeah, but you keep getting the wrong end of the stick, Casper. I've said it before. I'm not going to encourage people on social media to follow a poor girl called Paige around Dad. That's not what I'm asking. If you can't see the gravity of what you're saying, then you need serious help. There's no one called Paige. What have you done with her, Father? Nothing. See what's happened now? Yes, but nothing has happened now. It's the Paige. The Paige on Facebook. Well, I don't think Facebook should be naming things after Paige. She might not have agreed to it. No, Casper. No, I give up. Everyone just needs to calm down. The long and short of it is, you are going to stop following Paige from now on. Do you understand me, Dad? This is not acceptable. I just wanted people to follow this page. 